Hi, I'm Jim Hodge, pastor of Aldersgate United Methodist Church in Grand Rapids. Welcome to this edition of Sequestered Spirituality. Do you know what day it is? Well, Wednesday, September 16th, obviously. But what does this day mark? Some of you may say, well, I know that. In 1620, on September 16th, the Mayflower started its voyage to North America. That's why it's Mayflower Day, and it is. Another might say, well, well, I know that in 1908, General Motors was founded by William Billy Durant on September 16th, and it was. Someone may say, well, everyone knows September 16th is National Guacamole Day, and it is, but I don't think everyone knows that. Someone else might say, you know, in 1955, on September 16th, Plato was invented. Now, I don't know why we'd ever want to remember that, but that's true. Or someone might say, it's International Day for the Preservation of the Ozone Layer, and it is, but that's not what I had in mind. Or they might say that in 1963, on this date, the Beatles recorded their hit song, She Loves You, and they did, but no. Or they might say it's Step Family Day, and it is. It's all those things, but that's, that's not exactly what I had in mind. What I had in mind was, today marks the 26th episode of Sequestered Spirituality. We've been doing this for six months. And in honor of that, to mark this day, to celebrate all we've been through, I'd like to offer up a reprise of a past episode with some real improvement. I hope you'll like it. This is going to be your snack for this afternoon. Okay. okay. Are you ready for a snack? Uh -huh. Okay, Here, uh -huh. here's what it is. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Fudge brownies! Fudge brownies, yeah. Fudge brownies. Yeah, I made some of these a while ago, but I just made them for myself. So we're going to make them okay. for us. Okay. You think Baba likes fudge brownies? You don't think so. I don't think you're right. She doesn't. So the first thing we have to do is open the package like this. And then we have to... It smells delicious. Dump this right in here like that. Give one good sniff and taste if it's rotten. Okay. Then we got to put some other stuff in it. Like one of these. An egg. An egg. Can I crack it? I'll crack it. Okay, here we go. Whoops. Maybe I won't crack it. There's one. One? Can I have the next one? Here, let me help you. Ready? Oh, good job. Here it goes. Two. We got two eggs in there. And then we're going to stir it. No, not yet. We oh, got some other yet. stuff. What's this? Um, water. Water. Okay, Gavin, you pour the water in. All of it. All of it, all of it. Okay. The eggs in here, and you know what this is? Um, vegetable okay. oil. Vegetable we'll pour oil. it right in there. All of it? Yeah, over, over the pot, please. Okay. And the dump? All of it. There's more in there. Okay. And then, what we're supposed to do is... Stir it. Stir it until all the little particles and the eggs and all of that are all blended into... That egg does not want to go. Look at that. <laughs> that egg is fighting back. <laughs> but we're still going to win. We're gonna, okay, we're so we got all the ingredients in. Now we're still stirring. Gavin, let's have you stir again. Okay, no, why don't you take a turn? Don't lose the spoon. Just stir. Okay. Are the lumps gone yet? No, there's still a bit left. Oh. I think. All right, let me have a turn. Okay. So we're right. basically taking turns. Get all those lumps out of there. Because it has to go where? 
In the oven, right. So we got to grease the pan. I want to do that so that it doesn't stick. Grandpa's going to do the spray. Is that, is that bubbles or those are bubbles? Okay. Um, yeah. Then we just pour this. The whole thing. The whole thing right into the pan, right? Yeah. Doesn't that look yummy? It looks like yucky pop. Yucky Ooh, it chocolate. It doesn't look like yucky chocolate, Gavin. Yeah, it looks yummy. Not yucky. It looks like it looks like you. Okay, now I, I need that spatula. Yeah. You need the spatula? It's chocolate. All right, so you mm -hmm. take the spatula and you get the rest of it out of here because oh. that will bake too. All right? How much do you think is in here? Oh, wow. I don't know, probably like, um, Whoa. probably like half a gallon. Half a gallon? I don't know. What's a gallon? Is that like a ship? It's like, like one gallon of milk. Like oh, half a gallon. Oh, okay. Gallon! One, one jug of milk. But okay, like, so I have... We're like half a pint. I now have an empty pan. The chocolate in this one. Yeah. Can I look at? I have an empty spatula. And an empty spoon. And an empty spoon. And if Gavin gets his leg off the counter, that would be nice. <laughs> Gavin. So I have a spatula and a spoon, right? Because people who make it get to help lick the batter. Hmm. Pretty good. Is that awful? No. I'm, it's so delicious, I just want to eat the whole pan. Yeah? <laughs> okay. Let me know when you're done licking. Not yet. Oh, I can't put this in the oven until you're done licking. There's a brownie. Three half. There's a brownie. Mm. I don't think they're not anymore. And these are the most delicious brownies I have ever tasted. So do you think I ought to just bake brownies for myself anymore? Yeah? And not share them? No, I we want you to share. No. Okay. Hmm. You think there'll be any left when you come back next time? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, I doubt it. We might have to make another batch. Mm-hmm.